Who is this? Captain Isaac here. Hey, die, you scum! Republic privateer. Hey, duck! We're on the same side. Get that hangar sealed! Too many! Still trapped outside! Then cut them off! It's them or us! Sorry, Captain. We're under heavy fire. The Void Wolf. Without an immediate assist, we're gonna be red smears on the sidewalk. Sounds like you don't have much time. Get us out of here intact, and my whole fleet's yours. However long you need it. All right. The hangar's sealed. That should buy us a few hours. Get the injured to the back. Med packs are running low, so head and torso shots first. We're underground now, but the Void Wolf's got patrols all over Quesh. It's only a matter of time before they smoke us out. Give me some idea of what I'm walking into. I've been running adrenals and combat mods from Quesh to Republic Freedom Fighters in the Outer Rim. The Void Wolf took offense. He's got some kind of turbo laser barrage. Took down two ships, one shot each. I haven't gotten a launch off since. The whole planet's under an Imperial invasion. Come soon. I don't think we can hold out long. He's here. The captain's here! Ready the ships! We're getting off this sinkhole! Get us out of here, and everything you see is yours for the taking. I don't visit Imperial-occupied war zones just for fun. Yet somehow, you end up in quite a lot of them. Do you two know each other? Oh yes. The Captain does love his heroic rescues. Without his gallantry, I'd be stuck in a terrorist prison cell right now. Well, I'm glad to be privy to the Grand Reunion, but we got more urgent concerns. The Void Wolf's been using a powerful planetary sensor station to tag any ships leaving Quesh's surface, then his fleet homes in, and boom. The only way off is to destroy the station's sensor processors. You know anything else about this area, now's the time. The Void Wolf's men are everywhere, and they're only some of the Imperial troops on this planet. I'll give you the details, but this is definitely the place for shoot first, ask questions later. Just come back quickly when it's done. I don't want to be here when the Void Wolf retaliates. The station is working as planned, Grand Admiral. Not a single ship has gotten past us since the sensors went fully operational. Not a single ship, huh? So it's just the things right under your nose that you're blind to? Sir? I assure you, everything is under control. I have my best men guarding... Had? What are you doing here? I thought you were on the leash of that shrew senator. Your station's going down. I... I won't let that happen, Grand Admiral. I... I'm summoning my support troops. They're dead. Did you not figure that out? Oh, this is the problem with Imperial training. They only learn one way to solve a problem. I will bring you his head, sir. Him and everyone he came with. I will not fail you. I've sent my first ship out undetected. Looks like you really took their system down. Doesn't surprise me. Not after Terrace. He's better than he looks. I guess I owe you then, Captain. What can we do for you, once we've delivered these medicines to Scastel, that is? You keep supporting the Republic, and you don't owe me anything. It's cute watching you be noble, like I just met your good twin brother. When you see what the Empire does, it takes a hard, hard nut to turn Patriot. But it doesn't feel right to let you leave empty-handed. Call this my way of saying thanks. And I'll make sure your good deeds make it into the name you're building for yourself. Good day, Captain. I liked you back when you were just a charming rogue. I never thought you'd turn into a real Republic hero. What do you say we find somewhere a bit more private? Catch up a little. Did you invite the Void Wolf here just so I'd come rescue you? Maybe I should have thought of that. I've been wondering where you went off to. <clears throat> Alone at last. Next time I need a rescue, I'll know who to call. Hello, Captain. Thanks for making your way all the way out there. Your work on Balmora was superb. The Military Expenditure Committee has even stopped harassing me about my crazy privateer idea. 
And let me apologize up front. Hoth is hardly one of the galaxy's top vacation spots. Just drop the whole thing in a big Corellian whiskey, and it's fine. I'll toast to that. Here are the facts. Until a few years ago, Hoth was a frozen wasteland with zero habitation except the occasional pirate ship. Which would still be the case if we hadn't lost our most advanced secret fleet in the ambush above it. With the number of ships that went down, we and the Imperials are both stuck here, battling it out to claim this rotten ice slick. Battlefield tactics aren't really my specialty. That's not why you're here. Right now, neither the Republic nor the Empire claims Hoth's airspace. We were driven out by some witless pirates called the White Maw. Somehow these outlaws have acquired such a supremely advanced cloaking technology that they can outmaneuver both the Republic and the Empire. So you want me to steal the cloaker from them? Beg, buy, borrow, steal. We're not picky. This cloaking device, whatever it is, makes their ships basically invisible to instruments. We can't see them coming. We can't stop them, and neither can the Empire. We need this device, and we need you to get it for us. I can't promise not to accidentally blow up the planet in the process. You wouldn't believe my luck. I'll warn our commanders not to leave out anything fragile. When you get planet side, speak to Major Painan. He'll be your point of contact and tell you anything else you need to know. I'm looking for Major Pannon. What are you saying? I, I wasn't... I mean... You startled me. Uh, I am Master Langus Duno, Jedi advisor to the Republic forces. I uh, uh, assume you're from off-world seeking the poor late Major Panin. The late Major Panin? Yep, blown to jelly. I uh, hope you weren't close. Poor Major Painin died in an Imperial strike on the base a few days ago. Killed instantly. Ah, here are his notes. Senator Dodonna's privateer, right? Infiltrating the White Maw. It won't be easy to earn their trust. They wouldn't be sending me if the White Maw had out the welcome mat. True. These are some organized and nasty sons of huts. I, I mean... My child, the Force is dark around these pirates. They have great anger. Serious, serious anger, do you understand? You have to get at them from the inside. That means showing no loyalty to the Republic. And having something they want. You spend a lot of time thinking about how to infiltrate pirates, Master Jedi? Hey, I'm a Jedi. We've got nothing to do but think. These pirates are our greatest threat after the Imperials. I've learned more than I wish. Last week, White Maw pirates tried to grab a cache of ship-to-ship -ship sensors. If you could steal those, with the Republic's full permission, of course, they'd make a perfect goodwill offering. Steal? Permission? You want to take a breath and explain? So you fly into the base on a Republic shuttle, talk with the Major, and then come offering gifts? No. We've got to stage this, make it look like a real heist. The droids guarding the cache will have to defend it to be convincing, but I'll inform the Lieutenant in charge. I bet you were that kid at the Jedi Academy who short sheeted the Master's beds. Twenty hours of meditation on a cold rock every blasted time. I've got the coordinates here. The cache is inside a cave not too far away. Weapons on the floor! Hands where I can see them! Back up to the wall. Slowly. I'm supposed to be here. So let's chat about why you disagree. Are you the one Major Pannon was expecting? From the Lady Senator? Then, nope. I still can't guess why you'd be doing this. The sensors are for an important trade. Then you should have requisitioned them. You just destroyed some of our last functioning droids. <coughs> Jedi? You mean Padawan Guiana? She was with Major Pannon during the attack. Died in the same blast. Take these sensors. I just need you to fill out an incident report and... 
never mind. We'll talk later. You lied to me. Uh, yes, and I would love to discuss that, but I, I was just on my way out. Uh, see, there's a, a, a disturbance in the force. Uh, oh, no. I'm sure you have an airtight explanation for sending me to attack friendly forces, right? It's it's not what you think. I I am a Jedi, or was, you know, a Padawan. But I, I can see the Force. I just can't use it. They threw me out when I got caught with a cheat sheet for the Jedi Code. I didn't have any skills, anywhere to go. Skip to the part where you wanted me to attack the Republic. I ended up working for the White Maw. They, they dragged me here. They gave me to Shai Tenna, a weak way, one of their rising stars. He sent me for the censors. I admire your nerve, but you're an idiot. I don't want to serve them, really. I've tried to escape, but no one cares that I used to be a Jedi. The White Maw would as soon kill me as keep feeding me. If I don't bring those censors, I'm Wampa Bait. Please! Let me live. I, I, I know things about the White Maw. I, I can help you. Quit whining. You're giving fake Jedi a bad name. You're the real deal, you know? Most people would let this little kind of misunderstanding really get under their skin. I'll stop. Use those sensors to get in. That part wasn't a lie. I, I can set up a meet. I'll go tell Chaitena you're coming, and uh, send you the coordinates. You won't regret this. You underestimate his intelligence. Even the lowest fool could never think he's in the same league as the great Shaitena, my love. Compared to Rogan the Butcher and Nagdrayan, you're small time. Kipuna male tota ad mishka kabano tasema. Gaptula do bota dwana winki slimo. Poya tuka changa. You have no idea what a compliment that is. You are right. He has no idea. Chiliska chananga wa ninchi gospa inigo dade. Udiesh de naga. My love and lord has a rival. A Davaronian named Kandhar. Jitanka Iliska Chananga Bumpa Kambakni. Kandhar has taken favor away from my loving lord. So to gain his help, you must eliminate the threat from Kandhar first. I'm not gonna kill a man in cold blood. Akma noya chaskinoe. Kochuso yo mata chisoya. That drooling idiot knows nothing about Kandhar or what he's asking you to take on. Kandhar got those droids to his alliance with the Empire. He's planning to put his whole gang to work for them in return for help ousting the Gendai. You ever thought of escaping? Putting those talents to work somewhere else? Are you making an offer? Show me you're a sure thing, and we'll talk. The pirates here like being independent. If you expose this deal, Kandar's own men will tear him apart. There's a secret tunnel in the mines nearby. It leads to the spot where Kandar meets his Imperial supplier. Hide inside long enough. You should be able to catch him in the act. Kill him, or expose him as you like. Kandhar, the Void Wolf agrees to the terms of your deal. He will send the promised payment as soon as you secure your portion of the arrangement. What arrangement? Oh, was this meant to be private? Kill this intruder! How willing are you to die to protect Imperial secrets? He has a puño. I want to hear more of this. 
Why are we meeting with this Imperial scum? He's gonna turn you all into slaves so he can take over the White Maw. Kikunamo! Ubanchone Alipa! Istin Koto! Pampawula ji ota kakoga huta nupisto! You turncoat son of a hut! Silence him! Control your men! The Void Wolf makes no deals with weaklings. I'm not working for any Imperials! Yeah, blast the Void Wolf! We're free men! We're the White Maw! I guess a few of us had suspicions, but I'm glad you took out that swine before he could sell us all out to the Void Wolf. I'm guessing it wasn't just chance that you were waiting here. Shaitan has said this is my initiation into the White Maw. You come from him, I just wanted to give you a warning. Kind of a thank you. It's good to know the weaknesses of your enemies and your allies. It saves time sorting out who's who. Look, you want into the White Maw, Shaitana is absolutely the best way. But he's an ice-hearted, backstabbing, miserable son of a hut. Doesn't trust anyone. Kandhar's men sent for him before. He's got a personal shield generator, makes him basically untouchable. I'll just have to shoot harder. Won't help. You need to hit the generator first. Kandhar was going to try an ion grenade next. Figured the man's got shields, fight him like a droid. I don't want to cause trouble, just keep it in mind. If it saves your life, remember who told you. Kantar is dead. Now tell Shaitana to get me into the White Maw. Fantastic. Now we won't be handed off to the Imperials like unwanted puppies. Sadly, it also means a chance of my love and lord getting a blaster bolt between the eyes just dropped to nil. Is that a request? Anyone who tried that would need a better reason than me asking. The Republic will give you asylum. We can leave this rock together. What would the Republic want with someone like me? Alalia and I were just talking about you. Oh, my heart almost stopped when I heard what happened. I had no idea. I mean, I knew the guy was sleazy, kind of bloodthirsty, and not all that hygienic. But it turns out Shai Ten is here under orders of some big shot gangster, Rogan the Butcher. He's trying to bring the whole White Maw into Rogan's fold. I was going to kill Shaitana already. Now I'm gonna make it hurt. Do it quick. Shaitana's on a rampage. He's taken out half the leaders of the White Maw, and he's not slowing down. Whatever you're after, you'd better get it. And fast! I want Shaitana's head. It's Rogan's birthday this year, and I don't have a gift. Major Painin's note said you're after the White Maw's cloaker, right? I bet the Republic would pay good money to get it for themselves. I can help. When Shai Tenna started heads rolling, they moved the cloaker to an underground base for security. What's in this for you? Call it an overdeveloped sense of personal guilt. Plus, I'd really love to watch someone feed Shai Tenna his own teeth. The base is nearby through some rough territory. I'll run ahead, distract the guards. There's a back way in with only automated security. You should be able to handle it. Think of this as my way to say, I'm sorry. No, this isn't the way it... Captain, please, for the love of all that is good and righteous, help me! If Shaitana wants you to fight someone, fight me. You saved my life. Shaitana was going to kill me. I... First things first. There are Gand bounty hunters waiting in the next room, courtesy of Rogan the Butcher. Apparently, it was personal. 
Why were Shai Tenna's men trying to kill you? Oh, the usual reasons doesn't matter. The bounty hunters rake this whole place with that poisonous sludge they breathe. As soon as that door opens, that stuff is going to pour in here. If you don't want to drop dead before a shot hits you, forget the Gant. Go past them into the room and target the gas valves. Showing up and knowing exactly what I need is getting annoying. Look out! That's twice now. The saving my life. And I meant it before about not lying, so... Just give me a second. This is new ground for me. I work for Rogan. There, I said it. The whole reason he sent me to Hoth was to kill you, and... I don't want to do it anymore. The whole story. And I'll know if you're messing with me. Uh, I... I had no idea what you were really like. The Jedi Order. It's all black and white. Like, why try if I've already turned my back on the light? I ended up in Hawk to Rogan. He basically made me shy a slave. Told him to use me how he wanted. You did know they don't call him Rogan the cuddly defender of orphan Jedi, right? Hey, I thought the Butcher meant the guy couldn't be beat. Until I met you. You sweet-talked Alalia. Saved me. Turned Kandar's men against him. Rogan doesn't inspire half the loyalty you do. Let me make this up to you. I can get you to the Cloaker. No tricks, no traps. Where is the Cloaker? And what hoops do I have to jump through to get it? The White Maw's base is in one of the Republic's downed ships. Lots of guards, no visitors. I'll meet you there. We can work together to get past the guards and find the Cloaker. Though you might be surprised when you meet him. The Cloaker's inside. Just past those guards. They've got the key code to get in. But these guys aren't too bright. I mean, they're used to Shai Tenna's barks. They jump. We should be able to put one over on them, no problem. I'll follow your lead. Naya Memgen Kalikam. Kekua Nam Karak Naya Memak. Didn't anyone warn you guys about toffee and ice fever? No! I'm not sick! I, I am too young to die! Ah! Oh no! Everyone back up! If this is the ice plague, every drop of infected spittle contains enough virus to kill a dozen men! You talk to me, how that mean for a buru ni? Hanam jiwa nemok, hengam yama naya angam. Got the antidote. But it'll cost you. You'd better take it. There's only three doses left on Hoth, because the Empire's blockading supplies, trying to wipe us out. Kimbong Kam, Namak Akalak Keku. Exkal Hafamatin, Mihoyal Kifar Omin at Mi Blackford Zongro Room. Hand over the credits, open the door, and my associate will give you the cure. Thank you. Now step aside and turn around. The shot is administered to the posterior muscle group. Ice fever free. We weren't lying. Now, go in. The cloaker is in one of those cells. Sleep, sleep, my little one, sleep like a setting sun. Rest your eyes and rest your cries, and I will see you when you rise. Click! Ah, click! Starship's gone, Mama. All oh, gone. Hush, love, the starships are fine. Get some sleep. Well, if someone had to find out, I'm glad it was you. You've tracked down our secret weapon. I'm guessing he takes after his dad? I let him call me Mama because it comforts him. I'm the only one who sees him as a child and not a tool. He's a kidonak. We call him Trick because that's what he says most often. Read the White Maw's technological marvel. A poor brain-damaged child with a connection to the Force. When he's scared, 
He uses it to hide himself. It's his own bad luck the effect is powerful enough to extend over an entire fleet. The White Ma aren't big on hospitality. They're the ones who bashed in his skull. I nursed him the best I could, but his mind never came back. He can't use the Force consciously. It only works if he's terrified, so they torture him to keep him in a constant state of fear. Please, I've seen how you look at me. I can't tell you how long I've been waiting for a hero. You deserve better than a life of Shai Tenna's plaything. Hold me. Make me forget what it feels like when he touches me. Na nolia chuba. Mokili maklunki ni at ambompa boshuda. And you wonder why your relationships don't work out. Kipuna male tota ad mishka kabanotasema. Tula do bota dwana winky slimo, poya tuka changa. Oh, lay off! Stop shooting! Shy Tenna's not cracking the whip. We've got no call to fight you. The white maw cut us loose. It looks like the lady isn't so keen on keeping up the attack. So where to next, boss? Where? Is he talking to me? Are you ready to be my pirate queen? You make it sound like so much fun. I just don't know if... Tabana mine ships on Bespin. We'll hit them like we planned. Ready the fleet. Blasters at the go. Say, that was easy. You heard the lady. Get marching! Conventional shields only. As long as I'm in charge, trick is off limits. If I hear about anyone messing with the boy, you'll answer to me. I don't know how to thank you, Captain, but I can probably come up with something. Come on, boys. Let's show the Captain what we can do. Captain, Lieutenant Cole is here. We, uh met earlier, that business with the ship-to-ship -ship sensors. I spoke to Senator Dodana and verified your assignment, but there's a few things to clear up before you leave. I'm here. What do you need? I'd rather talk in person. I'm taking over Major Pannon's duties, and I want to clear up his records. Just drop by his office before you head off planet, all right? Uh, thank you for coming. So. According to Major Pannon's files, you are attempting to acquire the White Maw's cloaking technology. Do you have anything to report? Pirates just have a member with a unique talent for the Force. That's... disconcerting. I'll request a Jedi advisor immediately. So, if you have no other business here, have a speedy journey. Hoth is no place for civilians. So, Captain... Funny running into you here. You're making a habit of saving my life. I mean, uh, thank you for freeing me from this place and that sadistic jerk and, uh... What do you say we make this a permanent arrangement? This is just a complicated scheme of Rogans to drive me to suicide, right? See? And I'm so glad you brought that up. I know Rogan, I can help you. I'll tell you what he might be planning, where his stashes are. It'll be mutually beneficial. I'll be like your apprentice, and you'll be like my guy I tell things to. You got potential. You just gotta stop making people want to kill you. But that's my best skill. I see what you mean. Thank you so much. I can't wait to start learning from you. Just let me get my things, uh, and adjust the humidity in your ship. Uh, my skin is really sensitive to... Uh, uh, never mind. So what's the report, Captain? I have to say, I was expecting better results from you. What happened to the White Maw's cloaking technology? Let's just say it involved a beautiful slave girl, a backward child, and a weak way with a trapdoor fetish. I'm not even gonna ask. This arrangement seems to be serving you far better than it served me. Incoming call, Captain. That Darmus is on the other line. Come look me up anytime. So good to catch you in, Captain. 
I trust you're finished playing White Knight to poor little smugglers. If you're finding yourself at loose ends now, a business opportunity has presented itself that I thought might interest you. It takes credits to maintain this lifestyle. I assure you, this job promises to be quite profitable. Why don't you meet me at Port Nowhere, and we can discuss it. Perhaps over a game of Sabacc. Ah, what a moment for the Holo albums. Standing with two of the galaxy's most famous, or should I say, notorious spacers. Captain, I'd like to introduce you to Vaz Treniff. He's, um, how do I say this delicately? I rob ships. I thought you'd appreciate knowing that more than one of his hits has been against Rogan the Butcher. Wish I could have been there to see that. I'm the last one who was that's still standing. That mug's been coming after my crew since the last job we pulled on him. Picked them off one by one. Now the huts have my best vault cracker. We don't stop them, they'll sell them to Rogan for the price of his head. What's this we? Baz's partner, Combo, was taken by the huts while doing preliminary scouting for what could be the heist of the millennium. An Imperial Treasury starship. King's Ransom is in orbit just off Nar Shaddaa. I don't have to tell you the kind of credits we're talking about. You could be righteous and rich. I figured you'd want in. What kind of haul are we talking about? My understanding is this ship is carrying the product of all trade between the Empire and the Huts on Nar Shaddaa. Help me rescue Combo, raid the ship, and we'll split it 50-50. It's not often you get the chance to thumb your nose at Rogan, strike a blow for the Republic, and still walk away with enough to retire on. You don't have to lay it on so thick. I'm in. Rogan's Lieutenant Strilith is going to pick Combo up at a hut cartel safe house on Nar Shaddaa. Boz has the coordinates. I'll meet you there. If we don't manage to rescue Combo, deal's off. Everything is subject to negotiation. How long do you want to gamble that Rogan's empire stays bigger than mine? La pawa kolka, toroni kura wa wunda donko. Nakwa noya chosti na wikuchusu, yo mata chitoya. Crispa mon ki chis. Yo chanti chawa, choto ge kwanga choska. You kill everyone here, Captain. Who's to say who did it? Stroth's not known for working things out peacefully. Vaz, I, I knew you'd save me, Vaz, buddy. I, I just knew it. Frame Rogan for killing Rascuro. You cut off his ties to the entire Hut cartel. Hey, <laughs> Chubanaga. You heard the other option. Who do you want to be working with in the long run? Bumicha Kulka Dumaji. Told you I wouldn't let them hold you. I told them you'd come for me, Vaz. They didn't think you could do it. Thanks lots for bringing Vaz here. I was real scared without him. You shouldn't have let the hut walk, Captain. No points for live enemies. If I can do my work without bloodshed, that's how I prefer it. Everyone's got quirks. 
Now we hit the Imperial treasure ship. Darmus made arrangements for us to use one of the Republic's secret shuttle pads to get up there. I'll transmit the specs and meet you. Then we'll bilk those Imperials out of more credits than you've ever seen. Surprised to see me? Who do you think pulled the strings to let you use this shuttle pad? Darmus told me what you're doing. It's quite heroic, really. The Treaty of Coruscant forbids official strikes on non-military vessels. We're lucky you're not bound by that. I'd hate to have to share the spoils with the whole squadron. And I'm sure they're thrilled not to share the risk with you. Just a warning, then. The Empire is moving reinforcements into the area. I'd hate to see that handsome face blown into space debris. The shuttle pad's right over there. This is the ship we'll use to rendezvous. It's Imperial Salvage, so it's good camo. Combo's cracked a signal we need to dock with the King's Ransom. If the rest of this goes that smoothly, I'm taking you on all my jobs. Don't jinx us. Base filled with empty cargo containers. Me and Combo will hide in one while you pilot us in. In one? After you secure the hangar bay, pop us and we'll loot the vaults from inside. Will you hold my hand, Vaz? You know I don't like the dark. Didn't I show you I won't let anything hurt you, bud? Just climb in. Nice and easy. Spring us when we're clear. What do the Dark Lords possibly see in this scheme to replace soldiers of the Empire with pathetic, lawless criminals? Who are you? How did you get in here? If you don't have any valuables, I'll move to the next vault. Carry on. The ship is under attack. Call for reinforcements. The Void Wolf! The King's Ransom is under attack. I command you to use all your fleet's resources to drive off this invasion. Now, as you always remind me, I wasn't born to the Imperial military, so I may have the power structure wrong, but I'm pretty blasted sure I outrank you. We need to stop meeting like this. You're the one they're begging me to save them from? I guess there are things pathetic lawless criminals are good for after all. You're bound by the rules of warfare to send reinforcements when an Imperial vessel is under attack. Oh, did I not mention? The Empire just declared war on the Republic and all its representatives. And as Article 17 of the Xyos Convention states, an Imperial Admiral is justified in destroying Imperial targets at risk of falling into enemy hands. With the Captain's track record, I just can't take that chance. Get back to the hangar bay. There's an Imperial battle cruiser attacking the ship. The whole thing's gonna blow. I hate Imperials. Crazier than a hut on glitter stem. What kind of morons blow up their own ship so it don't get looted? He stumbled onto some kind of internal power play. The Void Wolf just took down three moths. Good. Let them blow each other up. Long as we got the money. Let's split and then let's split, you know? I don't want to chance anyone following. How much do we get? Here's everything I got. What do you have? I'll have Combo Tally. He's good with numbers and honest like a Jedi. Been nice working with you, Captain. You're good people. Come on, Combo. Let's go see what kind of hidey hole this hall can buy us. Thanks, Captain. Hands off the Senator. Captain, I thought you were dead. The ship, I saw it explode. Make fed the part on Hoje S. Futot ki a tengere. S a silgo terben a ser zet lakata. So, Captain, 
Are you the bad luck that keeps getting me attacked, or the lucky charm who keeps rescuing me? What are those things? Have you ever seen an animal like this? I've seen a lot of weird stuff, but those I would remember. Well, I'll pay good money to find out what they are. And how Rogan the Butcher got his hands on them. He's just managed to move himself from thorn in my side to public enemy number one. So what's the plan? Send a strike team? Sick the SIS on him? Why would I want to do that when I have you? Rogan is the Void Wolf's most dangerous tool. I think the time has come to take down his criminal empire once and for all. And I thought going legit meant I wouldn't have any fun. Just don't let your maniacal giggling make you lose sight of how dangerous he is. Find out anything Darmus knows about Rogan's businesses, and where he might have gotten those things that attacked me. Then, we can figure out how to best work this plan into the larger war effort. Welcome back, Captain. Senator Dodonna has already called to rave about how you just saved her life. Meaning the whole Republic's backing you when you finally take down Rogan. Not bad for somebody from the wrong side of the hyperlane. Did you find out what those beasts were that attacked her? Let me get the Senator on the link. She's going to want to hear what I found. out of a vote for this? Creatures Rogan sent at you seem to be cybernetically modified versions of native Vossian wildlife. Voss? As far as I know, no native animal has ever been legally exported off Voss. It's time to track down who's been playing zookeeper for Rogan. Voss is a strange place, newly discovered, very isolationist. I'll pull some strings and get you a landing permit, but it'll take a while. We shouldn't wait. Rogan's finally vulnerable, and the Captain's gained quite a reputation recently. If anyone's going to conquer his criminal empire, Captain, this is the time, and you're the man with the crown. I want to help the Republic, not run some crime family. Rogan is a weapon in the Void Wolf's hand. You can do the Republic no greater service than to eliminate him. Unfortunately, the only one who knew all of Rogan's secrets was his mentor, Ivory. And he disappeared years ago. That's not... Entirely true. Rogan's predecessor was arrested by the Republic. To my knowledge, he's still incarcerated in a top-secret facility on Belsavis. This is highly restricted knowledge. Even within the Senate, not everyone knows of Belsavis. You must not repeat any part of this. If this ivory's been locked up long enough, we should be able to buy his cooperation with a few rolls of spice and some shaving cream. It may take months to get the permits for Voss. Belsavis will be easier. Ivory and Rogan were like father and son. If you can find him, you'll know Rogan's hideouts, stashes, things we'd never find ourselves. This is a man who used to sell children to the huts for gladiatorial games. The Republic will insist on tight restrictions for dealing with him. But it's worth it. If you're going to war with Rogan, Belsavis will be your first battleground. I'll get the permits in order. Rogan has no idea who's coming after him.